All right, today we're back at George's, getting the, uh, the rest of the plane going. We kind of left off here with these spacers that I've seen other people struggle with. And uh, what we've come up with is basically shaping these spacers to make uh, room for the gussets down there. And we're just trying to figure out what size rivets, uh, but we're gonna stay with the 42s because 20 thousandths plus 20 thousandths Plus, even if we use the 40 thousandths uh, spacers that he made here to keep the skin from bowing out, plus 40 thousandths for the, uh, the welded tab, will bring us to 0.12, and that is still within the range of the AAPQ42 rivets. So, first challenge. Um, we're gonna mark those. We just marked a couple of center lines on here, and we're gonna transfer drill those three holes on it, and uh, basically looking to get the ball rolling again. All right, so we got the spacers in here and kind of feel that this is looking better than I remember. So I don't think we're gonna do our additional 40,000 spacers, at least not for now. So then our next plan is to do the bottom and the intelligent one among us had a great idea. And what are we doing, George? We're going to uh, recheck all the angles to make sure everything lines up with the, for the, um, uh, that it's the true. Yeah. yeah. So basically what that means, we did this uh, early on, um, before the summer, and we're going to reference this, this back all the way up to the firewall. Um, we're going to do that with a laser level and whatever the degrees are in the, in the instruction manual, we are going to make sure everything is straight because this part here, this whole aluminum tail section mates to this welded cage and basically you have one chance to get it straight. Now, before we attached it here and here, we made sure that was straight. Now that we put the spacers in, we're gonna do the same thing across the bottom, but before, prior to drilling any of this, the, the holes through the skin, we're just gonna double check all that, so good call. So now we're basically freed up the bottom here because we had all these blocks in there. So we lifted it up onto these blocks and we simplified it instead of having stacks and stacks of wood. We customized our little supports here. And of course we had to measure it all again. So we got our, what was it, 88.7 degrees here. And we're still at zero degrees across this brace back here, all the way up to the firewall, including um, we tapped it off of the engine mounts and also on top of the, the wings. So very, very level. And now we're gonna do this bottom support piece. And I think we have to order a piece for here and uh, basically get it ready for the next. Thank you. 